Hey there guys, I'm Dinks564 and this continues to follow Let's Play of... Oh, who's that? Uh, oh, that's the guy probably that we saved, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And this continues to follow Let's Play of Uncased, so why don't, why don't we talk with him? Oh, good day. Skinny but muscular guy is laying in the hospital but surrounded by uh, semi-transparent tube, uh, sh tubes. A sheet of paper on the wall uh, with the tiniest possible trace of blood, says the patient. Patient's name is Charles Holiday. Uh, the prone man turns his head slightly towards you. Where's your beard, Saint Peter? Saint Peter? He laughs at his own joke and immediately falls into the coughing fit. One of the tubes running from his chest spatters red with droplets of blood. Uh, the black immediately stops laughing. Sorry, I feel exactly as shitty as I look. And thanks, I guess I owe you my life. What went wrong with the mission? All there emits a hor uh, Horace uh, sigh, and the tubes connected to his torso quiver sympathetically. I mean, why am I still alive? It's because those fobs had nothing but clubs, but they still did a pretty good job. Sorry, I'm having a hard time thinking straight. Morphine must be doing its job. It's it's good shit. I recommend catching a bullet one of these days to, and trying it out. Where exactly was his fight? Uh, Squad attack? Kepler didn't tell you anything, did he? Yeah, uh, he's real sorry, but I don't remember a damn thing. Okay. I wonder if he saw anything exceptionally odd? Yeah, I was 12 when my mom murdered that out. Okay. It seems to have... I seem to have seen her, their, their queen. Oh. F the fops queen? There was a hill and there was a car at the top. It was a bit of a blur now, but I remember her crowned head clearly. Turns out it's no fairy tales. Those freaks do really do have a queen. Of course, that's not going to re in the report. They think I lost my marbles, like the blind guy at the and at the brothel. You know, you know that one. Shit, I can't remember it. Can't wait to get my damn thoughts together. Encourage him by telling a joke. You tell a joke about an old lady who shoot pigeons away by telling them to fuck off. Nice who thinks it's brilliant. Okay. Well, off we go, I guess. Uh, probably. Let's go to the residential. Before we talk Please to... To... Uh, Katarzyna, right? Uh, we'll probably want to go and... Uh, talk to Jack. Because I think I will... If, if, it is, if it is possible, take more than two. I thought there was a like limit of two from some perks that we took uh, or not two but we've seen like there was a uh, something about that there uh, where is the administration in offices right floor level minus okay I'm wondering if yeah he's here Jack is here let's talk to this guy maybe he'll reward us with something Tell him you found another actor who doesn't mind broadcasting work. Yes, we already talked to him. Cheerful Jack would be a perfect fit for the newscaster position. I'm back again. Hey, you there. Jack gives you an inquiring look. So, you came for an autograph after all, huh? What's he's no. doing these days? Jack thinks about the answer. Well, all kinds of creative stuff, I guess. I thought up a new project. The documentary Jack's Baron. We could unravel the story with hyenas. I blow them up, make clothes of their hides, eat their meat. We could find some expressive house to the west that I could defend from fops. What do you say? You could play a fop in my film. Your appearance is very fitting. Uh, yeah, I'll offer him to travel together. Jack looks at your companions and shakes his head. No, it won't do. I've been sitting in this desert so long that I've kind of gotten rusty with people. Oh, yeah, okay. So, yeah, apparently I do think we have uh, a limit of of two companions. It was mentioned in some of the... I wonder if four, F4 four selects all of them? Nope. Huh, even F3 doesn't select anybody. F1, F2, F3 doesn't select the third person. Okay. 
probably the um uh, actually wait maybe we can report on one of these stations right to kinsley Mm. I've been to one of the facilities. Well, I'm listening. Report the condition of Sonora Bunker. Partially destroyed, then. Okay, I'll write that down. Thank you. Do you have anything to report? Nope. So, how's our... 61? I, I believe it didn't change much. Okay, then. I think we're as ready as we'll ever going to be. Um, might as well go talk to Katarzyna or something. Let's go to the little board here and medical aid station. Okay. Floor level minus four. Laboratories and hospital. Okay, and turn off the contamination, the contamination, because we don't need it right now. Right, she's well, she was over here somewhere. I don't think she will join us. So, but maybe, maybe some characters can join us if there's three of us or something like that. I don't As know. As you approach, Katarzyna dives for cover behind the glass table with test tubes on it, hiding her face in the usual manner, recognizing you. She looks out warily. Listen, only you can help me. Happened. A little grimace of suffering appears on Belitskaya's face. My co-workers, friends, acquaintances, they're surprised I'm here. I mean, they're not happy I'm here. Not happy at all. And life without this electron isn't much fun. I can't get any doors open. I have to hide from cameras. I'm stealing food just to have something to eat. Her voice is trembling. I'd ask her what she needs. Katarzyna fiddles nervously with her sleeve. I thought we were getting along well. And I've gotten used to you. We should keep hanging out together, don't you think? I can forge documents and cook. Okay, I can't cook well, but it still counts, right? Yeah, sure, uh, if you want to. At the companions behind yeah. No, that's too many people. They may be good folk, but... It's just not for me. The companions accompany you on your travels are usually living people. Okay. Managing a large squad is not easy, which is why only two companions can accompany you. I think I'm good with what we have. Like, it probably would be a good idea to have Jack, but he's a Melier and we have a Melier. I think it's better to have her because. Like, it's easier to apply range damage to, like, focus range damage on a single target, is what I'm thinking. While Crumb will be in the front, like, taking hits, mostly. Huh. Or maybe, you know what, because Crumb has some traps, skills, ah, uh, it's fine. Fine, I think we'll go with you, go. Anything else I want to report here? I don't think so. Yeah. Can we, like, move all the way to the exit from here somehow? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Okay, let's go to the hole then. Floor level minus one. Um, where is the... right, exit is that way. What damage, by the way, does her gun do? Precision plus 15, evasion minus 25, initiative minus 7, energy damage. Okay, but a lot of it, though. Alright, let's reload. Oh, and let's reload his gun as well. He might need to at some point. I can actually give her that psychic glove. I wonder if she can use it. Or did I sell it? I'd have sold it. Yeah, probably did. 
Okay. Right, by the way, do I put this... Uh, can I put this in the hand? No. Well, why don't you, like, grab a couple of them here as well? It didn't work when, like, we tried to throw them. I don't know if it means we need, like... It doesn't say anything about that. Like, it doesn't say we need traps or anything to throw them, so... I'm not sure why he didn't... wasn't able to throw them. Okay, now we'll go to the... Uh, picnic area. I'm thinking. Uh, where was the exit? Right over here, right. In the firm, Magellan Station parking lot is under attack. Scary issues that you, uh, ensues and you realize that something is wrong. You decide to find out who's interrupting your peace and quiet. Turns out that a group of hostile raiders are clearly preparing to attack. I understand that uh, that fight is inevitable. Try to hide by attacking... Uh, Try to hide by attacking the enemy while they can't see you, I guess. Now you're gonna get it. Where are we? We're over here. That's a lot of dudes, I have to say. This guy's digging here for some reason. Okay, can you? Uh, why can you not shoot? Oh, that's... Oh, that's one of us. Okay, uh... Sorry. <laughs> I thought... No, wait. Yes, no? Yeah, that's one of us. Okay. Uh, that's why I couldn't shoot him. Because he's one of ours. I thought he was one of theirs. <laughs> that's why I shot him. I don't want to, like, start a fight with... Uh... With Magellan Station, though. So. Why wasn't he attacking? Like, they were right here, then. And, yeah, this guy's digging because he is... <laughs> he's just an NPC who's digging. You're dead, out. Okay, and there's a guard. Oh, it hurt, by the way. Oh. Oh. Hmm, he has our PK. Maybe if he dies, we can pick it up and Punch give like it to Yuko. Kid. We'll we'll get in closer. I'm thinking. Oh, she moves a lot. She's fast. Well, he's fast too. It's just me that who's slow. Oh yeah, he has panacea. Should I keep it? I wonder. Um, what can kind of negatives? Oh right, it's minus one to all the stats. Well, except for strength, his other stats I don't think matter all that much. So why not? And her, right? I need to give her stuff. <laughs> Get ears. They give one percent plus one to perception plus one to charisma. Minus fifteen to authority. 
Can do I want to give it to her? What is this, by the way? Purple relic stone. I guess we'll need to scan it. I think there everything else we scanned. Can I like equip it on her? What's the benefits of perception, I wonder? What's her stats, by the way? Just generally. She has perception of 10. Effects initiative, learning ability. My perception gives a chance to notice something. Okay, that might be good. But... I don't want to reduce her precision. Initiative learn ability. Yeah. Initiative plus three, max AP plus semi AP plus three. That's okay. And well, I guess we'll get closer as well. Okay, these guys are just not engaging. I'm okay with them killing this guard. So if you, you could do that, that'll be good. Oh, she can actually shoot all the way from here. Well, she has a sniper rifle, so I'm not sure why I'm surprised. Precise shot. Hit chance plus 20. Takes six actions. Hmm. <clears throat> this one will be five. Lock shot. Uh, sure. Let's lock shot this guy. Just so he wouldn't be able to shoot us. And that'll be fine. Uh, not shoot us, but get closer to us. Um, okay, make your way over here, I guess. And you move in closer and attack. I, I wish it would just move me closer if I had click. What the hell are you doing here? You're gonna be more effective in a second. Mm, he's running. I really hope he died. Ooh. Did <laughs> they're throwing the hit at Oh it at him, but <laughs> but they're throwing it at themselves more or less. Ooh, that was a lot of damage there. What is this? Why is it Why is she all like poisony and stuff? I guess she had some sort of a glow on her, but Okay. We can do a couple of... Wait, we can do precise shot and then we can do regular shot. Yeah, let's do that. And save one more action. Uh, you... I guess you just move forward. Scared? Why are you scared? Uh, I don't know. Maybe she did something? Yeah, she probably did something. Okay. Over here, will we be able to shoot from here? Nope. Okay, then move just as much as you can. Hopefully he'll burn alive. <laughs> Hopefully he'll burn alive. <laughs> like, out of context, that sounds super, super bad. Now you're gonna get it. Smack you up. Okay, not cool. You probably will just take two shots at this guy, right? Yeah, let's focus this guy. Oh, oh come on. Missed. Twenty-eight percent chance to hit, really. Okay then. Uh oh, we need to reload. Yeah, but, but he's fine here, so he'll just take a couple of shots here. Okay, and you maybe... 
Root. Let's shoot her with flame. And that. Hey, what the what the hell? I thought we're in we were on our side. Why are you shooting me? I am the law. Hey, okay, how about we move her a little bit forward? Even though she has super long range, she's not very accurate at, at that long range. Uh, go go ahead over here. And jab her. Cool. Let's, let's get moving. Will he die? Yes, he died. Cool. I'm actually very much okay with that. I really hope I'll be able to pick up his machine gun. Um, Yuko, why don't we... Actually, no, no, no firing line. Okay. Uh, yeah, just a couple shot against her. Oh. Nice. And go after him. I think that's all of them. Yes, that's all of them. Let's go pick up the machine gun. Oh, he doesn't have machine gun. Unfortunately, I, yeah. I wish I, they would leave like their weapons as well. But they don't. Which is unfortunate. What does boss have? Nothing much. Okay, fine. Let's go. Let's go to the picnic, I'm thinking. Yeah, we'll go to the picnic first and then we'll we'll finish all other missions there. And then we'll go... No. Oh. You notice several... Mounts alongside the road. Looks like someone picked the spot for a small graveyard. Then you hear a muffled voice from nearby, statically with interference as if it's coming through a walkie-talkie. If anybody can hear me, please help. Okay, the sort of the sound. Staring at your... St straining your ears, you quickly find a radio lying on the ground. It's damaged as if it had been hit with a heavy object but still working. The crackling voice from the radio sounds again. Please, somebody, if you can hear this, I've been buried alive. I don't know how long, how much longer I can last. Uh, well, let's try to find the bird person. Can anyone hear me? Uh, let's save. Hiya. Oh God! Really? Who is this? Damn it! It doesn't matter. Listen, I've been buried alive. Please, I need need help. I don't want to die like this. Try to calm him down. Your th your smoothing voice has a desired effect. Now that he knows you're going to help, he the bird man breathes slow somewhat, and his voice sounds more even. Okay, okay fine. Please, just please hurry, okay? I don't like confined spaces. Ask what happened. Group group of blacks. We were escorting me and found four others. We didn't, we didn't know where we were going, but we had an idea that what they planned to do with us. One of us tried to break free and injured a guard. As a result, everybody but me was shot. I was alive, but uh, and ordered to to bury the bodies. Which has the frequency. The interference is getting worse. The connection is about to fail. Uh, after making a few. Simple adjustments, you're able to hear the buried man voice again. I remember that while I was digging, the guards were eating something. They laid, they left behind trash. Radio starts getting sh uh, straight again, adjust the frequency. I remember there was a heap of some kind of m metal junk nearby. 
Bird maze was signal interference, you are losing signal. Try to increase the signal. Okay. The cold birdman story. He and four others were being led by some uh, blacks, presumably to get rid of them. One of the prisoners tried to escape, and the wounded guard uh, and wounded the guard, resulting in all prisoners except for the bird guy getting killed. He himself was forced to dig the graves for the others. The birdman said that the guards were eating something. While he he was digging, they may have left traces of their meal. He also said that there was a pile of metal junk nearby. Okay. Uh, Weber and Mauro craved. Uh, how about we save here? Margrave. King Can. Uh, okay. This one is probably it. Uh, nope. Oh, this one. Maybe the Margrave one? Because there is trash. Nope. Hmm. Okay, but these are bottles, not food stuff, right? Pink can. Huh? Oh, there's a stack of equipment. Okay, this is the one. Oh, he's dead. How about we reload? Yeah. Oh, no, no, no. Because uh, now I know now I know what I'm looking for. I was just assumed that well we found trash that means that's that that's that but no we need to find traces. So and I guess it's it depends which which grave we undig first, right? Probably. Yes, yeah, stack of equipment. Okay, this is the one, right? Oh shit. What? Wait, what? I thought it was this one. Because it fits perfectly. Oh, there's there's that. Okay, okay. Mm. Yes, no? Well, there are only components, there's no food. Well, this is the only one that fits then. Well, I guess there is some food there. Okay. Oh, yeah, he's dead. Well, okay, let's try again, but this time I'm just interested. What, what will he. Uh, what it will be? It's not like it, it's important or anything. Neither story wise nor in terms of. I probably will not get anything anything super useful out of it. I'm just interested to see what exactly will it do. It says stack of equipment just like this one. So, will it be the one? Because I'm not entirely sure if it's uh, randomized or not. Hey, he's alive. Oh, hello there. Orange face flushes red, and he breath his breathing gets st strained, and he flashes his arms and fran frantically scans the horizon. Damn, I feel like I've been born again. Fuck. I never noticed how much space there is around me. Okay, thank you. I owe you my life. If, that, if it was possible to have children under the dome, I'd, may I'd name the first one after you. Seriously. 
Yeah, sure. Patient with orange yield possible. Okay. I don't even want to think about what would have happened if not for you. Of course, I'm sad about the guys, but uh, there's nothing I can do about that. I'd love to find those black jerks, though, just to see the look on their face, on their fat monkey faces. Uh, okay. What happened? Yeah, like I said. Oh, a mild hunger. On the radio. They led us to like cattle to the slaughter me and four other guys one of my uh, one of my guys couldn't stand it lost his nerve and pounced on the blacks he wounded one of them but the only result was everyone's getting shot except me but uh, they spared me so i could dig the graves so i was digging my my friend's corpses uh my friend's four corpses lying uh, oh right, right. I, I was digging my fr friend's four corpses lying nearby and this bastard sat down to eat and as if nothing happened. After that, they all lit up cigarettes. I asked if I could have one. Uh, I ain't a fool. I knew what came next, so I was sort of like a last wish. But this absolute fuckers said no. I let that th let that sink in. The last one of them got got it bad. One of the uh, the one who was wounded before. He was sitting up against the tree across the road. I hoped that. Prick would, uh, is warm food by now. And that's basically it. They kicked me on the on the head and woke, I woke up in the dark. They threw that radio in the box uh, with me to mock me. Except it, I, it wasn't as broken as they thought, sons of bitches. Um, okay, why was he handcuffed? Yeah, it's pretty damn obvious that from where I'm standing. Apparently, the blacks were, aren't able to communicate with anyone unless he's handcuffed. Well, okay, let's just break the can ha handcuffs. How's he feeling? Examine the wounds, use your medical skills, treat his wounds, and goodbye. Hold on, not so fast. Uh, there's something else. One of my friends who got snuffed, his grave is next to a tree. He took a relic from some facility, so... I guess, well, take the relic for yourself, kind of like a reward for, for saving my life. Okay, he's burnt near the tree, you say. Which, which tree? Well, I guess let's, let's uh, untake this grave, huh? Probably this one, Terence Wu. Or this one? Nope. This one, maybe? Nope. Oh, this one. There's a tree over here. The, the, like, there are tree, trees everywhere. <laughs> so, you know. Nope. Um, I mean, I mean, we might as well dig up all the graves, right? What? What? What are you talking? Which? Which tree are you talking about? This one? Nope. Notable hunger and thirst. Okay, let's eat. Well, we have some of that, right? Might use it. Okay. Oh. I have a lot of uh, stuff to drink. This one? Also ne next to a tree, I guess. Nope. Uh, this one, then. Oh, no. This one is the, uh, the corpse. Oh, that might what exactly actually what happened. Like the relic turned him into a corpse, or necro thing. Okay, shoot, shoot. 
Wait. Okay, you can go over there. And jab it. Okay. Yeah, that's probably what happened. Yeah, that's a relic. Fortitude, evasion, minus 10, initiative, minus 3. Okay, that makes sense now. Alright, scan this thing. <laughs> so this is like... The tissue of those in contact with the relic show increased re resi resistance to physical harm, but the reflex of the sub... Okay. What about this one? I don't remember where I took it. Energy resistance plus 15. It's, it's okay, I guess. Did I pick it up from one of those robots or something? Maybe. That we fought. Okay, let's get out of here. But actually, you know what? I think I'll make a cut here and we'll continue in the next episode. So thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed it. And goodbye.